Hey, YouTube Bearded CB82 here today with CNG Tip of the Week. As you can see, we've got a relatively new turbocharger here. This is only a month old and she's already gone bad. Uh, one way to tell what's bad, well, the actuator for it, which is on the back side for the wastegate, back here behind where my fingers are for my gloves, uh, seized solid month old awesome stuff quick little way to check these when you start getting uh, certain codes you know where it says check the air valve that sends an air signal up to here to control your actuator which is right here and it has an arm that goes all the way across on the back side with linkage uh, to where your wastegate valve is it opens up underneath you know underpower and everything else and allows a certain amount of exhaust gases back in through the EGR system. What you need to look for, best way to test them, unhook this little blue air line down here at the bottom, hook it up to shop air, uh, see how far your actuator moves. This one moves less than an eighth of an inch and it should be having a good full swing to it and it doesn't. So she seized, we're going to be changing her out. but. Just a little bitty way to check her out. Anyways, bearded CB82. Alright, since I got everything apart here, I thought I'd show you guys. Here's the actuator I was talking about, or the wastegate I was talking about. And it is seized where it's not closed all the way. I got everything swapped over onto the new one that I need. This is your arm that's on the underside. Don't forget, on the back here, you got your outlet temp sensor. That you need to take off where you get everything apart. I about forgot that today. Almost made it fun. Anyways, so here's the actuator. Here's the arm. Here's where it passes through the turbo for the wastegate. So once this seizes, nice and solid, she shot. Send her out. Later.